I love this so much. I just, going to Jamaica. Going to Jamaica. Going to Jamaica. Hey. Hello, stylers. Welcome back to the Full Styling Channel for another video. My name is Nadia, and I am the creator and founder of Full Style Inc. <laughs> okay, so this video, today's video, I'm so excited because I am in full preparation mode for my trip to Jamaica. Going to Jamaica. Going to Jamaica. Going to Jamaica. Hey, I'm gonna be on the island, man. Oh, I'm so excited. I've been wanting to go. I've been wanting to go to Jamaica since I legit was a child. When I was playing the crap out of the cassette tape that my dad brought me of Ziggy Marley. Especially the Arthur theme song. Those who grew up watching Arthur know what I'm talking about, okay? Yes, you can't, you can't come over here. The door is closed, it's closed. Jeez Louise. So, I'm so very excited, I'm finally going to Jamaica. This is a lifelong dream, and you guys have been, um, if you watched last week's video, I was prepping and making some things to wear on my trip to Jamaica, as well as some gifts to give to my friends. And so today's video, we're going to be styling a few things. I'm going to be throwing some looks together, stuff that I've purchased and stuff that I've already have in my closet. It is still a girl on a budget type of thing over here. So we're going to do that. But first, I need to pull all the things out that I need. I've, I haven't really started packing. I've been like throwing stuff in the suitcase because I didn't like, I don't like stuff sitting in boxes in my room. So, um... All of this goodness here, and then I have some other stuff. So I'm going to start off. I guess I'm gonna start it off as if I was there and what I will wear each day. And the first thing I need is an airport look. Not the most exciting thing, but you know, you need something to wear to the airport, and I still want it to be kind of cute. You know, I don't want to go there and just be like. You know, cause I wanna show up in style, so let's start there. Okay, so airport look. I have two ideals. Obviously I need one for coming and going. Um I originally wanted to wear these cute little floral pants that I've had forever from Torrid. I originally wanted to wear those there with my white slides that I left downstairs so that they're easy to take my shoes on and off, but I'm going through, you know, security and I'm able to put like my little footies on when I get onto the, before I get on the plane because it's always so cold. I'm always freezing on the plane. Um, but I think I want to be cliche. I want to be cliche and I want to wear my Bob Molly shirt. Now I've had this Bob Molly shirt for years. I thrifted this, but um, I recently and I recently did an upcycle toy. I distressed it and I splashed some paint on it. And I kind of want to be a cliche and I kind of want to wear my Bob Molly t-shirt. Um, I got to think about jeans i want to wear with now it's gonna be warm it's gonna be warm here in chicago and when we get there so i have to consider that because what i would like to do is wear this with some joggers i want to be comfortable see i wish i had another pair of my black nike sandals I wish I had another pair of the Nike sandals in black because then I could wear the black because those are so freaking comfy. Okay, so I'll be back. Let me see what I can do. Okay, so mm, mm, probably not the hat. Probably not the hat. I do, I have some black thick frame glasses coming, sunglasses coming. So that, imagine that, with my backpack, my carry-on. I'm not 100% sold in these joggers. Oh, 
I'm not going to the airport with my leg out. <laughs> I've already decided that I'm going to order me another pair of my black slides from Target. They're like $10 um, to wear. To wear. Because I was going to bring my white ones. So again, not the glasses I will wear, but choose your imagination. My hair up in a bun. I am getting braids. Because what girls, what black girls don't go on vacation with braids? Either wig or braid. Come on. But it's cute. It's casual. It's the airport. That way, when I get on the airport, I can always use my my dress as a blanket to cover my legs because they're always cold. And I am going to pack a blanket. So, my poor look number one. Yeah. I like that. I, I feel like this is better. Like this is better than tying it. Airport look number one. Next up is the day that we get there. We're getting there early afternoon, which is perfect. So we've already decided that we're going to meet by the pool. We're gonna get food. We're gonna get drinks before um, we're gonna take a moment to like rest, get comfortable, settle in, and then meet by the pool. And we're gonna have a just an afternoon evening by the pool, and then later that night we're gonna meet up in my girl Shariah room. We're gonna have a game night. But first, what to wear by the pool? And this is where things start to get interesting. So I slowly want to work the people into a frenzy. Okay, we'll start off cute. We'll start off a little safe. Dare I say basic? And then hit them over the head with the walk. You know what I'm saying? So, shall we begin? Okay. This is what I mean. It's a calm before the storm. Now, for me, this is calm. For me, this is basic. Um, OGs, you'll probably remember this swimsuit. I did like a swimsuit um, fitting room try on, and I tried this on, or I did like a vlog. I can't remember. But I know this has definitely made an appearance on the channel before this is my first two-piece this is the oldest woman suit i own this is from torrid this album anyway this, is, this was a very popular swimsuit two-piece set from torrid it's one of my favorites i haven't worn in a while so this is what i'm thinking for you know when we first get there and we're chilling okay the pool has a cute swim up bar. I'm in the water. My hair is up in a bun. I have the skin glistening. I have my sunscreen on. And I am in my fantasy. Cute, right? Yes. Love this. See? And so this one got pulled into rotation. And I said that I was just going to give them like a subtle elevation of the good. So. This is number one for day one. What do we think? Again, use your imaginations on the hair. I am going to bring the bag because I love this bag. I thrifted this last year. And I have not been able to wear it out. So she's coming with. She's going to be my little beach pool bag. Yeah, we love it. All right. So, I still don't know. I said that Wednesday night we're going to be meeting up in my girl Brian's suite for a game night. So, not really. Now, I'm going to show you what I wear Wednesday night because we all have matching shirts. We all have shirts made and it's so pretty cute. That's going to be a reveal. I do have to think about bottoms. I think I'm going to bring my overalls. My short, my short overall. Yeah. I think my short overalls. Yeah, I think they're gonna be worn. I do wish I had like more red or yellow bottoms. Anywho, so I'm bringing in my caftans from um, Amazon. The drop, um, Katie uh, Sorrento Sorrento collection because I love 
these they are so comfortable i have two of them and so i'm gonna bring them and this is what i'm gonna be wearing around like the resort so like when i get up in the morning and i go get breakfast i'm gonna be in it this one be in when i get up because i do plan to get up and like watch the sun rise go sit by the beach do some journaling and stuff so this is stuff i'm just gonna be wearing around the resort because why not put like a cute bralette and like just like some shorts and keep it pushing so day two first full day but day two we're going to go to the bob molly tour and we're gonna do the river bamboo rafting fun so the look i wear for the bob molly tour is the same look i'm gonna be wearing on the river rafting so i have to keep that in mind so i know i want to come out with a look for the river rafting i want to be on the raft like mm, mm. Ah, so I need to give the people a little something and I need to still be comfortable because the Bob Marley tour is going to consider walking. So I do have some white sneakers coming and my girl recommended that we get some water shoes. So that is pending, posting, shipping as well. Um, but in the meantime, I'm just going to show you how these, you know, how I will put something together. All right, you ready? Let's go. So this were things starts to elevate okay it starts to get out of hand so OGs remember this cute little number I like to call it my citrus my citrus fruit set and I'm thinking of wearing it with my cute little cover-up that I made my little sheer dress this was a tutorial I've went back and like made some corrections to it so we have the swimsuit. Oh, I'm starting to think that I should have filmed downstairs so I could put the, the air on, the fan on, because it is hot. And it's not even that hot outside. It's like 60 degrees. It get warm. Okay, so swimsuit, basic, not basic. Cute. Oh, adorable. I love this swimsuit. <sighs> My favorite. Okay. Swimsuit. Oh, Jesus, remember this? I wore this when I went to Detroit. For a body positivity plus size swim um pool party love this so cute this is from eloquy since 2019 it's the last time i've been outside Ooh -wee. all right so i need i need a bottom so i'm gonna go with these cute little white floral shorts that i got from torrid doing one of the most traumatic times of my life i ain't gonna say traumatic time the most one of the most traumatic trips of my life <laughs> so cute little basic so i could stop here i could stop here because it's hot in jamaica you know i could stop here i'm going to my white shoes just to show how the whole look will look again we use it our imagination gotta find somewhere to sit so the piece of resistance I see, I need to put tags in my clothes because I never know which one is the front or the back. I don't think it matters. Yes, sit down. S sit, sit in your chair. That's why I cleared it off. Hi, Furball. Say hello sit to Sit down. Hi. So, here we are. Hi, here Furball. Here we are. Right? Say right. hello. Say hello. Mm. Oh yes. Oh, I'm about to rub your belly. The for a bag and sunglasses. I'm gonna go with my gold aviators and my pineapple bag that I've literally had for seven years. I know citrus and pineapple don't go together, but in my mind, this works. So I can be hands free. I do have a fanny pack coming. So I'll hopefully, if, you know, I'll be able to wear the fanny pack. But this is cute. And I have like my little personal fan because it's going to be hot. I don't know if I'm going to try to have a hat on. But this is cute. And then I'm always able to take off layers. Like if I want, when I get to the wrapping, I can take off my shorts. Or I can just take off the cover up. So, 
This is day two. Outfit number one. We'll be wearing this most of the day. So cute. So cute. Oh. <laughs> so cute. I'm <laughs> so next up we're gonna be having a dinner for my friend Briar's birthday and of course in Briar fashion she has given us a dress code and the dress code is sexy and I heard this and I said say less sexy in my way of course so I have a cute little dress it's not I have a cute dress this adorable dress. This is the perfect vacation dress, okay? Perfect vacation dress. This is, once again, from Amazon The Drop. This is a collection with it is Juliet Fox. It's Juliet Fox. See that? Perfect vacation dress. She had two dresses to offer. I was gonna get both, but I just went back and ended up getting this one. So cute. Now, I'm not gonna try it on because I will be wearing this braless <laughs> and I need tape support um, and so because I don't want to just waste the tape just for the sake of trying it on I'm gonna say this so just use your imaginations I don't know what shoes I'm gonna wear this with yet I may just put on my pink shoes because of the bag that I'm gonna pair it with this bag goes perfectly with this dress this is uh, the Creation Original, my own boutique and brand. Uh, this is an old printed scarf that I made into a bag with these cute little handles. And the colors go perfectly together. Like it was almost as if I brought the, the bag because of the dress or vice versa. And because it's very light, light pink color. Oh. I'm thinking of wearing my pink and my case. But if I don't, I can always wear the white little um, sandals that I have. Either one will work. And so this is for dinner. This is sexy. It also has a split on the front side. So I'm going to be getting leg. It comes with pockets. It is made with cotton. So it's perfect for hot weather, tropical weather, vacation, because it will be breathable and breezy and comfortable. I'm so very excited about this dress. So that is day two, night, look number three, four, four, look number four. Oh, I have more looks. I'm tired, y'all. So day three, look one, the girls are having brunch. So this is a mixed group of people going. Um, it's not just a girls trip and it's not solely a friends trip. However, my core group of girls will be there. So that core group of girls, we will be having brunch. Yeah, we will be having brunch Friday morning. Well, afternoon, morning. We'll be having brunch before we go off on our next excursion activity. And so I need a cute brunch look. This cute little floral is going to wear. I've, I've now made it a floral set. So we have the floral um, tropical floral pants that I made last year, year before last year, from um, Mood Pattern. Um, really, really love these pants. I really love that pattern. I've used that pattern two times since. I made another pair of pants and then I made a cute pair of shorts. All, all have tutorials too. All have videos. Um, so, cute little pair of pants. Breezy, lightweight. It's going to be perfect. They're long. They're flowy. And then you guys saw in the last video, I made a cute little, uh, using some Remainer Eyelet fabric that I've had for quite a while and finally made like a dress from. Um, made a little bustier crop top. And then I used the remainder of this fabric to make a short, cute, kimono so this is going to be a cute little breezy brunch look with the white sandals and i may or may not have a bag because we're going to be in the resort we're just going to 
go off with just us and have a cute little boozy brunch. So excited about that. Now I should try this. Um, I really don't know how this swimsuit fits. I tried on every other swimsuit, even the brunch. I mean, try and decide if I should try on this swimsuit because I don't know how it fits. I legit. It sat in the box for a week until I got my luggage and I threw it in my luggage so I don't know how it fits. I know how to dress. The cover fits. <sighs> I'm tired of trying myself on. I'm tired of trying myself on. This has reminded me how much I do not miss one pieces. <sighs> oh, uh, okay. So this is cute. This is cute. Um, I do wish this was a two piece. <laughs> But here is the swimsuit. It fits, but it is a bit of a struggle to get on. I'm not gonna lie. And at first, I thought my I thought my ass, my butt was not gonna get through the neckline. I do not miss one piece. <laughs> um, but it's cute. I do love the print. I really, really do like the print. And then I got this cute little crochet cover up. I always wanted a crochet dress cover up. I will be wearing this outside. I'm just wearing a little swimsuit. This is gonna be so cute this summer. A cute little pair of shorts, either my denim shorts or like cute black shorts and like a bralette, a tank top, a crop top. This is gonna be cute. And then I could take it into the fall like a blazer over it or a shirt underneath it with like a leggings or a pair of jeans hike it up a little bit always one on one so and of course i have a matching bag again this is a creation original from my old scarf made into one of those japanese style knotted bags it matches with the swimsuit perfectly the colors align anywho so it's my white shoes, um, glasses. I have some cute pinky glasses, but for the sake. So I really just wanted to try this on just to see if this one fits. Girl, I would have been upset if I got all the way to Jamaica and I was trying this on and it didn't fit. And I would have been like, I have to rewear a swimsuit. I gotta figure out how to make that play flat like that. But that looked better. See, that looks youthful. You're welcome. See, this is what I'm talking about, the elevation of looks. Now, Saturday, Saturday is an exciting day because Saturday we are going to a boat party. The boat party is going to be an all-day theme. It's going to be stop at Margaritaville. And this is where we're doing something cute and fun because you know black people love a theme. We are having a melanated swimsuit thing amongst our group that, you know, originally set out to go together. I ordered... This cute little one piece with this cute little cutouts. I'm gonna insert a picture of what it looks like because I'm not trying it on. From Target, from um, Finale. Finale? 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 Um, which is a black woman owned uh, designer, black woman designer. Um, she did a collaboration with Target. You know how Target been doing these collaborations with these black content creators and black designers. And not just black, but like, well, they do have the black collective designers. But, you know, Target been out here reaching the people, reaching the masses. And I love that. So I picked up a few pieces. This is one of them. And it's so cute. I do love it. I wish I would have got the, the pants, these khaki um flowy loose pants that look like they made of linen and it would have been perfect with this look but i didn't instead i got um i did get some sunglasses that already packed up and then like some jewelry <sighs> but i will be pairing this with this um brownish um linen curtain material that i was working on i made a cute little uh skirt with it with a high slit in the front and as you can see i don't know if you can see this on camera i told you guys that this matches perfectly with the swimsuit like they're in the same color range just different tones you get what i'm saying like they both like that brown but this is more of a brass bronze and this is just more of a matted like it's perfect it's it's almost like again 
that I brought them together. But I did it because I definitely had another another material plan for to wear with this, but it was too brown. And um, oh, you know what? I'm gonna be bringing. I just remember. I'm gonna be bringing. I I'll bring her. I bring her. Yeah, I'm gonna bring her just in case. She's a just in case. Just in case um I get tired of wearing my cap dance. So I could throw her on. This is um from Target again. This is with Tabitha Brown's collection that she did last year. I was only able to secure the one piece, which is the dress. Oh, and the earrings. I forget. I got more than one. I got the earrings. And that so I'm gonna be bringing her she's just in case and then I need um, an airport outfit so it's gonna be those floor pants and I'll probably just pack like my white tee and yeah on my way back I just have one flight but on my way there I have a layover so I definitely want to wear some shoes that are comfortable since I will be having to walk through three airports instead of just two I think that's it, stylers. This video is probably like 20 minutes. Hope y'all enjoy it though. But the brunch. That'd be cute. So I can have a bag. I can have, you know, something to put on the gloves, hand sanitizing in. I think that's it, stylers. I'm so very excited. Oh. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I will be going live next Saturday. So what day is it? The 20th? the 20th i will be going live saturday the 20th over here on youtube i will be doing a sit down and pack with me i will be packing everything last minute packing if you guys don't want to see me pack or sit and talk while i pack let me know and i could be doing something else or we could just have like a regular sit down but to give me a break from having to worry about content and focus on finishing up some projects and preparing for this i will be going live uh what else what else what else so meet me there i will be i will post like a reminder and i will post like something on my communities guys make sure you keep me your eyes on that community tab if you're watching to the end of this video thank you so very much i love you if you watch to the end of the video type in the comments it's hot outside <laughs> Type down below. It's hot outside. If you watched to this point in the video, thank you so much. I love you guys. Remember that you are loved and you are worthy to be loved. But most importantly, always love, always remember to love yourself fully. Until next time, Stylers. I'm going to Jamaica.